I'm sorry, I didn't hear that. Ken Franklin finally got a hearing aid about three years ago. My family kept after me time after time, Dad, Ken, please, we're tired of repeating everything we say. He's one of a dozen volunteers Consumer Reports had purchased pairs of hearing aids to assess the shopping experience. They can be expensive. One pair costs more than $6,000. And it turns out getting the right hearing aid for your needs is no easy matter. Two-thirds of the 48 hearing aids were not adjusted properly for their wearers. In addition, a lot of shoppers didn't get information on features that could have helped their hearing aids' performance. There are all sorts of hearing aids to choose from, and Consumer Reports says no one hearing aid is good for everyone. Your first step is to find a person and place to prescribe and fit your hearing aids. Ideally, that's an ear doctor's office, which usually will employ audiologists. Consumer Reports says when shopping for a hearing aid, discuss your lifestyle. Ask about a telecoil if you talk a lot on the telephone. Consider a directional microphone, which helps people hear in noisy environments. And find out about digital noise reduction, which helps reduce annoying background noise. When you pick up your hearing aids, it's critical to make sure that they're fitting properly. You need to have several tests done, and one that's crucial is called the real ear test. That test measures the match between your hearing loss and the response of your hearing aid. Mm -hmm.